Hey everybody, it's your girl Angie. Welcome back to Kiss My Cheeks TV. It is that time of the month, Boxy Charm. Another Boxy Charm review. As you can see, it's a nice Valentine's Day box, but nothing in this box I love. Like you all did not show me any love this month. You know, I give an overall grade. I think last month I gave y'all a D minus. This month I might give y'all a D plus. Y'all need to step it up, BoxyCharm. Step it up. Y'all know I'm not going to cancel. But I feel like if I get another D box, I'm, I'm going to be close to canceling. Like, I'm willing to give y'all two more months. But then that might be it. Let's jump right into it. Let's make it quick. Um, pretty much everything in this box I'm willing to give away. It's a few things. That's why I did a look. I did glam with my own makeup and not what's in this box. I do have a little cousin, I think I said it before, who's a starting MUA. So I sent a lot of makeup to her so she can, you know, get her collection up for her clients. So a lot of this might go to her. But if you're interested in anything, I am willing to give pretty much everything in this box away. Just get in the comments and let me know if it's something that you like and I could possibly send it to you. Okay, let's start first. Let's go with this I'm definitely giving away. This is the, oh Lord, it would be something I can't say. Trey, Trey Steak Eye Duo. It is an eye pencil and a mascara. I haven't opened anything, but as you can see on the box, it's just a mascara and an eyeliner, nothing fancy about it. Um, this retails for $44. I have so much mascara and I have so much eyeliner. I have my favorites. My favorite mascaras are Big Ego by Tarte, Fenty's Fly Line, not the Fly Liner, but whatever Fenty's mascara is. And I also love Better Than Sex. That's Too Faced. So if you're interested, let me know, $44 for an eyeliner and an eye pencil. Nothing too special about that. Up next, this is a skincare brand I've been wanting to try, Tula Skincare. This is the So Poreless Deep Exfoliating Blackhead Scrub. It retails for $32. Um, I don't have problems with blackheads or, you know, problems with scrubbing my pores or things like that. I am a skincare girl. I love to collect skincare, but I feel like this is something that will probably just remain under my sink in my skincare basket because I just don't really do a lot for blackheads because I don't have that problem. So I will be giving this away if you're into Tula skincare. I do want to try some of this maybe in something else because I have heard a lot of good things about it. Up next, this is the Evo. Beauty Pore Fit Primer. It's supposed to be like perfect, but perfect primer. It is a moisturizing primer with a matte finish that creates a smooth, poreless base. I love a good primer. Now, this is something, and I love a good matte primer because I, I, I'm I now into matte skin. I used to love the dewy look, but... I think just the older I got, the more oily my skin naturally becomes. So I just put on a little bit of highlighter and that's it. But I love a matte finish. But some of my favorite primers are Benefit, um, the matte primer from Benefit. And I have an Elemis primer. And if I do want a dewy primer, I love that new Huda Beauty Juice Moisturizer for a dewy primer. So this retails for $23.00. It is in the giveaway pile. Up next are these glam, glamoury. I don't know. They're some brushes, child. The only thing I love about these brushes, I love the cute little travel pack. I might. I said everything is up for giveaway, so I have to be honest. I love these because they have red. I haven't even opened them. They're red and it's kind of like water in them. And it's all glittery hearts. This is like the only Valentine's Day thing in here. But as you can see, I have a million brushes. This is probably the flat brush where I probably would pack in my shadow. This looks like a blending brush. 
I have a million blending brushes. I don't need another one of these angled brushes or another one of these flat brushes. Like to me, these are throwaways. These are only two that people probably really would use. These retail for $30 for these four brushes. Okay, BoxyCharm. Okay. Last but not least, you know, BoxyCharm always gives us a palette. Um, I love Ace. Is it Ace Beauty? Or I call it Ace Beaut. I don't know. <sighs> Nostalgia. $38.99 is what it retails for. I love the packaging. If you look at the packaging, these are the colors that I'm always into. I love a good orange. And I'm starting to get into greens. I love a good green eye. This is a very bright, vibrant palette. I haven't even swatched it because I want to give this to someone. I love every color in here. I would probably use almost every color in here. The oranges, the golds, the yellows. These speak to me. I probably am not a pink person. I'm not really a purple or red person. So it's what, four colors out of this I wouldn't use. The more I look at it, the more I'm like, girl, you want to give this away? This looks like an amazing, amazing, amazing palette. And this is a great eyeshadow brand. I really love their mattes and their shimmers. But I'm probably going to give this to my cousin. But that's it for the boxes, y'all. Anything else outside of this palette? Like, I'm probably going to give the palette to my cousin to add to her collection. But anything else, just get in the comments and let me know. And I can send it to you, like... No point of clogging up my already overly crowded makeup room. And that's the review. Get in the comments. I really want to know what you are getting your boxy charms. Is it me? Am I the only one a little bit disappointed? Like feeling like boxy charm is starting to go downhill. I have enough makeup where I probably could cancel. <laughs> but I, I like boxy charm. You know what I do with boxy charm? I spend the most of my money on these pop ups. And add-ons. I spend probably a good hundred, two hundred dollars every month at a pop-up or add-on. That's where Boxy Charm. That's that's worth paying this twenty-seven dollars for this box a month alone because you can get so much good skincare. I'm talking about name top of the line like Glam Glow, Glow Recipe, Elemis. Fenty, they had those Fenty powders on sale for $18. Fenty lipsticks for $5. Like, you can get so many good brand products for so cheap in these pop-ups and add-ons. But that ain't what this review is about. Let's not make it long. Like, comment, share, and I will see you all later. Bye.